Imagine finding yourself on the battlefield of the future. Around you, high-tech combat vehicles move, packed with advanced technology. They are faster, smarter, and more dangerous than anything you've seen before. Today we will tell you about one of these machines, the Hunter AFV. Why is it considered a formidable force on the battlefield? Watch until the end to discover the unique technologies hidden inside this machine. The Hunter AFV is an infantry fighting vehicle developed in Singapore. It was created to replace outdated armored personnel carriers that no longer met modern combat requirements. Development began in 2006, and by 2019, it was officially commissioned into service. But what makes it special? To start with, the Hunter AFV is the first fully digital combat vehicle in the Singapore Armed Forces. This means it uses advanced computer systems for operation, communication, and combat functions. Unlike older vehicles, where the crew had to rely on limited instruments, everything here is automated and integrated into a single system. Imagine sitting inside this machine. In front of you are large touchscreen displays, 360-degree cameras, and digital targeting systems. You don't need to peek outside to see what's happening around you. All data is displayed on the screens in real time, while an integrated artificial intelligence system helps analyze the situation. Now, let's examine what this machine can do in battle. The Hunter AFV is armed with a 30mm Bushmaster automatic cannon, capable of piercing the armor of light tanks and enemy fortifications. Additionally, it has a 7.62mm machine gun, and if needed, anti-tank missiles can be mounted. This means the vehicle can engage a variety of targets. But weaponry is only half the equation. What about protection? The Hunter AFV is built with strong armor, capable of withstanding armor-piercing bullets up to 14.5mm caliber. Furthermore, its underbelly is reinforced against mines and improvised explosive devices, making it highly resistant to battlefield explosions. Another crucial factor is speed and maneuverability. The Hunter AFV is equipped with a powerful 710 horsepower diesel engine, enabling it to reach speeds of up to 70 km per hour. For comparison, that's the speed of a regular car. Thanks to its tracked system, it can traverse mud, snow, and even small bodies of water. This vehicle isn't just for combat operations. Several specialized versions have been developed based on its platform, including engineering vehicles, recovery vehicles, and even bridge-laying machines. For example, the engineering variant is equipped with an excavator and a crane, allowing it to clear roads and construct defensive positions directly in combat zones. Now, Imagine this scenario. Enemy forces have taken control of a strategically important position, and there's no way around them. What can be done? The Hunter AFV moves into action. Thanks to its digital system, the crew quickly receives reconnaissance data, selects a target, and delivers a precise strike. The enemies don't have time to react because the machine operates with lightning speed. Another advantage of the Hunter AFV is its ability to connect with other combat units. It can exchange data with drones, artillery and infantry in real time. This means soldiers always know where the enemy is and what threats might emerge. Now let's analyze an interesting aspect. Why did Singapore, a small country, decide to create such an advanced combat vehicle? The answer lies in its focus on technology and high combat efficiency. They cannot afford a massive army so their military equipment must be as effective as possible. And indeed, the Hunter AFV has already proven its worth. The Singaporean military actively uses it in training exercises, and recently, it was announced that even more units will be ordered. This indicates that the development was a success, and in the future the Hunter AFV may even be exported. Now the question arises, can this machine compete with Western or Russian counterparts? For example, when compared to the American Bradley or the Russian BMP-3, the Hunter AFV excels in digital technology but falls slightly behind in firepower. However, due to its advanced electronics, it can operate more efficiently in combat. In conclusion, the Hunter AFV is not just another combat vehicle. It is a true mobile command center, capable of changing the course of battle through digital technologies. It has already become a symbol of Singapore's future armed forces and may serve as an example for other nations. If you enjoyed this story and want to learn more about the military technology of the future, subscribe to our channel. Hit the like button if you found this interesting and leave a comment on which combat vehicle you'd like to see in the next video. See you in the next episodes.